25-year-old Stephen McDaniel would murder his neighbor after a long period of stalking her. He would later go on national TV and pretend to be innocent and act as if he cared for his neighbor that he murdered. Yeah, Lauren was my neighbor. Um, we're just trying to find out where she is at this point. I mean, no one has seen her since Saturday. I mean, the last time anyone heard from her was an email that she sent out, and I mean, no one's heard from her since. Did you see her hang out with anyone at the time, anything like that? I mean, no, no, no one has seen her since Saturday. I haven't seen anything. I mean, you always hear noise outside, but it's just people walking by pretty much. And you, uh, she just recently graduated from Mercer? Yeah, she and I, were we were both JD students. Um, we graduated back in May. What kind of person was she? I mean, how did you, what did you see? I mean, because, I mean, we went, at, we went over, one of her friends had a key. We went inside and tried to see if there was anything amiss, but, I mean, she had a door jam that was sitting right by it, so there was no sign that anyone broke in. I mean, the door was locked when everyone got here. I mean, we, we just don't know where she is. I mean, what about um, in the, like, the parking lot area? I know they've been doing a lot of, I think that's where they have recovered the body or whatever they recovered from there. Body? Um, had you heard, any, had you seen anything there? Had you seen anything there? I, I mean, we don't know if this is the same person. You know what I mean? Like, they took out a body there earlier. We don't know if this is the same person or not. So that's how we're trying to ask people if they know who lived there. Are you okay, sir? I think I need to sit down. Okay.